Welcome to Bill Dance Saltwater. Great fun fishing that anyone can do. Yes, you can do this. Destin, Florida is one of Bill Dance's favorite fishing destinations for many reasons. It's located on the Emerald Coast of Florida and has always styled itself as the world's luckiest fishing village. We're not sure about the luckiest part, but the fishing there is fantastic. It claims to have the largest fishing vessel fleet in the state of Florida, and the area is nothing short of famous for its white beaches and emerald colored waters. Bill comes here often and usually fishes with his good friend and well-known area guide, Daniel Pike of Inshore Angler Charters. They normally go for either speck trout or redfish, but this time, they'll give bluefish a try. With laterally compressed bodies, bluefish can reach 4 feet in length. They normally weigh 1 to 3 pounds, but sometimes reach 13 pounds or more. The world record is 31 pounds 12 ounces. Bluefish are preyed upon by shark, swordfish, tuna, and wahoo. And they consume anchovies, crabs, croakers, mullet, sardines, and shrimp. Today, our fishermen plan to cast light in hopes of some really fun fights using bomber flare hair jigs on light tackle and line. Let's see how it works. What puts the concentration to these blues in, in select areas? Well, what they do is they come in this harbor and they just go around like a horse trap looking for forage, feet, stuff to eat on along these docks. Well, the reason why we're going back here is because where it's a tighter area, it's a higher concentration of them. Out here, yeah, we could get them, but we'd have to bounce and move and keep moving. Back there, we're just kind of catching them in the narrow where they're coming through feeding, and we just have them, you know, like bottleneck. And there is a high percentage of feed back there, too. Oh, yeah, all through the whole harbor there is. They're just moving around constantly. We're just kind of catching them in a tight area. I got you. So pound for pound, inch for inch, they're one of the toughest dudes that swim this harbor. Yeah, they are tough. They're tough fish now. <laughs> they, they'll stretch your string and they eat. And on this type of tackle, they'll give you all you want. They'll give you all you want. That's hopefully the America's fixing to find out. <laughs> well, put me on them. That rainstorm's coming, though. You know the people that own this boat have? Nope. <laughs> you don't but light is, but they, they don't matter. They, this, this lightning. Well, I saw a big streak of lightning. Yeah, it, you don't I, think they'll mind us parking here? They ain't got a choice. <laughs> there is no choice. If somebody comes out of here. Well, that's fine. They can come down and join us. All right, catch it front. There you go. That power pole is good for multiple things, ain't it? I'll tell you what, it's handier than a pocket on a shirt. Another big dark cloud back there. Yeah, there's one more one more little thing coming. I looked at my radar bills. One more little thing coming that, that should be wide open after that. There you go. Got him, man. Got him. Oh man, what a bluefish. Watch him jump. We can take it drag. Whoa, can we catch it up a little bit? Whoa. There it goes again. Oh, I'd like to catch this fish so bad. No, he's coming back out. There he is. Boy, what a bluefish. I'm gonna bring him in to you. You see him jump? <laughs> he's about he's about 12 or 13 pounds. Oh, what a bluefish. <laughs> I don't miss that one. Oh. I'm coming across. Hold on one second. In the rain. There he is. God. He ate that jig, did he? <laughs> yeah, he did. <laughs> oh. What a monster blue. Like that, look at that. Look how big that blue is. Going. See ya. <laughs> that was a big old blue fish <laughs> right there. So if a family wanted to come down here, bring them a spinning rod with, you know, either push button or something like this, get in a boat with you with a sack full of jigs, you could go out and have a ball. Yes, they can. We got beautiful beaches, great restaurants, some great fishing. You have people come fish with us, don't eat. They, they stay at a place like Pelican Beach. 
not even a mile and a half from my dock. They wake up, the fishing charter leaves at 5.45 in the morning, they leave their condo five minutes before the trip, and they're already on my boat pulling off. Well, I'm going to tell you what, those bluefish, <laughs> but they, when they hit, they get their hat, don't they? When they, they get, ready when to, they get up about seven pounds and bigger, man, on that light tackle, they'll give you, they'll give you a fight. Look, look at him right there. Look at him right there. Yep, look at him chasing baits out here. They're eating baits everywhere. Watch this. Come on, come on, come on. Hit it, hit it, hit it. There he is, got it. Yep, look at that. Wee! Look at the size of that bluefish. You talking, that, that's a full grown. You're talking about maxing out your fish for that reel? Like the big bulls we caught that time, the redfish, this is no different right here. That is one monster bluefish. I promise you, let it settle down. Don't put so much heat on it. I'm telling you, take it easy. That is one monster blue for Destin, Florida. Some people fish their, their whole life and never seen one that big here. I, I guarantee you. <laughs> That's about like them 30 pound, 40 pound reds we were catching, isn't it? Yeah, but I'll tell you what, on eight pound line though. Yeah, this is, it's, it's fun, ain't it? It don't, it don't get much funner than that it's right there. That way. is one big blue right there. That is one big blue, buddy. He, I think he sees a net heat. He is not wanting to come to the house. Swallow well, the G. Yeah, he did, he did swallow his right. Oh, man. Oh, 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 man. It looks like a big salmon going man, into that. That, that, <laughs> that, 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 I got one. I missed him. I got one. Oh, I missed him again. Uh-oh. 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 I missed mine. This ain't good. He knocked the living fire out of him. I'm going to put mine down to get back here with you. Oh, he's going for the piling. Let's see what the pro can do. Let's see what that man can do. Watch Uncle, Uncle Daniel, boys and girls. Watch his rod go limp right here. Watch this. He's in the piling. If he can get that fish out of there. Look, 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 look. Ooh, that's a red, isn't it? Oh. I think it's a monster bluefish. It's a monster bluefish. All right, I'm going to get the boat. God. Clean to the back of the boat where I can work. Ooh. I've got... I'm and so, you see, see the heat I was putting on yeah, him? you did. With that 10-pound line, you did. Man, son. Son. Ooh. Dude, that one. Okay. Whoa. I'll fix to put it on him if you just get him up here. Oh, that nice. That's a nice on that light line. Yeah, What's that eight pound test, isn't it? Yeah. Ooh. Man, there's everything I could do to get him out of that dock. All right. <laughs> Look at that, boy. Look at that. That's a nice blue right there. About, about eight or ten pounds. There he is. That's a good one right there now. About eight or nine pounds on light tackle, eight pound test, man. You see him trying to get me in that dock? <laughs> yes, I did. You, you, did, you did good on him, son. I never thought you'd get him. <laughs> I never thought you'd get him. For 10 pound test, I mean, you can catch those. They catch them up on the East Coast bill with big, big uh, trolling rods. We're catching them here on these little th Cabo 20s, man, with eight pound test. You did good, boy. Today's equipment log is brought to you by Gamakatsu because the fish of a lifetime only comes once in a lifetime. God, just missed him right here at the boat. Here comes the rain again. Somebody Hold on here, throw this side. They're chewing. Oh, I got him. Oh, there we go. I got okay. him. 
Not underneath you. You got him off. Oh, son. They are taking some drag, ain't they? Boy, what a blue for light tackles. Man, that is fun. This is that Cabo drag. Boy, they're taking that drag, ain't they? Oh, he's smoking it. Oh, man. Man. Oh, I got a blue. Oh, yeah. Man. Look at the size of that blue. Look at the size of this blue. Mine's bigger. I knew you'd say that. See ya. This weather's crazy, isn't it? Yes, it is. Sunny one second, rain in the next. There he is. Pull, baby, pull. I don't know what you are, but you are strong. Eight pound line. You trying to catch all the fish up here or what? Trying to catch one. I've lost the last three I've had on. <laughs> you know, light tackle fishing bill. That's bills. a bluefish and a knife. Oh, that is a good one for light tackle. It's not like them big ones on the East Coast, but I'll tell you what, light tackle, baby, you don't get no funner than this. All right, here you go. Fall off or do something. Oh, oh. You got one? Oh. It got me at the boat. Calm down. We'll need the pliers, I think. I got it. Whoa, oh. Oh. Do you think saltwater fish are stronger than freshwater fish? Do I? Yeah. Uh, yeah, most of them, I think so. Do they have sharp teeth? I put my finger in his mouth. I don't know. Next one I catch, you can film him and you let me know. No, no, no. I already seen a guy do it one time, and I'll tell you what, I want no part of it. I mean, I'm not going to mention who it was on national television, but uh, he's in this boat. He's rolling back there. I don't know about that. I don't know, rolling? Rolling. I don't know about rolling to say anything, shut but I promise the, you. Shut up and fish. <laughs> there he is. You got him? Good deal. Good deal. Whoa. Whoa. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Keep him out of it. Uh-oh. Let's see you do your deal. Oh, oh Ooh, look, look at that. Boy, that adjustment. <laughs> that is fun right there now, boy. That really, I like that deal. Now, I'm not kidding you. That's fun, ain't it? Man, I like that. He might come up, he might show us again how far he can jump. You get him up here by the boat, Whoa. he will. It ain't no I'll small either. Thing, that thing will out pull a five or six pound smallmouth. Oh, man. I'm telling you, he will. They are strong. Whoa, here he goes. He was jumping around, wasn't he? Look at him. Woo! Still cutting it. Look at that. Oh, I'll tell you what. Boy, Ooh. they pull good, don't they? Let's see. Uh, uh, uh. Whoa, whoa, bye. I don't want to get them teeth on my hands. Today's fishing tip is sponsored by Lowrance and the new Structure Scan Sonar Imaging option for HDS. Change your view with side scan plus down scan imaging to cover more water and find more fish faster. Get the whole picture with Lowrance HDS plus Structure Scan. Few things influence saltwater fishing more than tide and current. Tides are predicted according to the position of the sun and moon in relation to the earth and winds and weather systems. Tide and current are often confused. Current is the horizontal flow of water, while tide is the vertical rise and fall. Current is judged by speed, whereas tide is judged by height. There he is. Oh, 
Oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, did you see that? That was quick. <laughs> Don't worry, man. You got that Superman chest vest on. You ain't got nothing to worry about. The good thing, I had my mouth closed. That thing would have gone right down it. Oh, 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 oh. Come on, come on. Take it, take it. Look at that. That's yonder. a nice one right there. <laughs> this will work you to death. This will work you to death, boy. Look at that. There's nothing to the yeah. There he is. Whoa. Oh, oh, oh. Go, little drag. Look at that drag. Ding. I can't stand it. Which way is your line? My line. It's coming right off the bow of the boat. Hey, look out. Look at that. Oh, Ooh, look at that. Oh. Like a small mouth. Oh. Boy, that's a nice one right there, Bill. Man, that's a nice blue. Boy, I'll tell you one thing. That, that, <laughs> I love that. Now, I'm telling you the truth. That is fun. Don't act crazy. Little big old mouth full of teeth. <laughs> That's a nice one right there. I gotta get my pliers on that one. I got them. There they are. Ooh. Boy. Goodbye. What we've got, we've got a little bomber, flare jig, little quarter ounce. And attached to that, we've got a section of 50 pound fluoro, fluorocarbon line and a little 50 pound crane barrel swivel and attached to that we've got eight pound test and we're using these little spec red quantum rods seven foot medium action rods and daniel has got one on and we're using a little combo 20 reels so and they give you all you want with this absolutely a little light tackle and i mean to tell you it's fun ain't it oh absolutely and anybody can do this. Absolutely. You can do this. He can you help. You like getting your string stretched, you come here and do this right here. This is a blast. What I say. You can do this and he can help. Golly, look at that blue. Come on around me. That's a nice one right there. Oh, oh man, look at that. <laughs> Jump just like a small mouth. Is that not fun? Yeah. I'm telling you what, I can't take a lot of that. Well, that one you caught a while ago, Yonder, he jumped two feet in the air. Yeah, they're fun. They like to jump. You see what them teeth did to my jig? Actually, one good thing about it, it's Bill's see, jig, not mine. That's inexperience. You should learn to retie periodically. Ooh. Mr. Dance got him on. Uh-oh. Let's see how good you are. Uh-oh, look at you got the lucky turn. You got the lucky turn. He's coming out. Oh, he's going back in. Oh, that's, Ooh, that's a, a nice one right there. Boy, that's a good one on light tackle right there, man. You don't get no funner I'm than that. I'm trying to keep him out of those holes. You mean, you're, you're not going to be able to pick him up. Let me net him, Bill. Oh, I can get him. Let me, let me net him. Net him? I can do it better. I can't get him out of that net. What are you doing, dude? Well, Look at that. That's a fine one for light tackle right there. Oh, you better. Oh, that's strong. Ready? Man, man, man. I, I tell you what, we've had a fun, fun afternoon. You know that? Yes, we have. I tell you what we ought to do. We ought to head in, head up to Christmas Wharf, and get a great big bowl of their famous gumbo, and talk about all the fun we've had. Please let's do it. Time for that. Go up there and have us a good time. How's that? Right, let's go. You for ready? It. Let's go for it. Thank another, you, buddy. Another good trip. Had a great time. Thanks. Surfing our email is brought to you by PowerPole. Now, when shallow water fishing, you can quickly and quietly stop your boat and keep it securely in place, even in heavy wind and current. Ask your marine dealer for PowerPole. Is the mighty tarpon, or silver king as they're often called, legal to harvest in Florida? Tarpon can only be fished recreationally in Florida. Most anglers practice catch and release since the fish really has no food value. However, anglers can possess them for trophy purposes at the cost of $50 per tag per fish.
Without this tag, possession is illegal. Now for this week's Bill Dance Saltwater Travel Log. Bill and Daniel were fishing today at beautiful Destin on the Emerald Coast of Northern Florida. Visit the website or call the number on your screen for more information about this fantastic destination. We want to thank Captain Daniel Pike for his expert help during our trip, and we highly recommend his guide services. Accommodations for today's show were provided courtesy of the resorts of Pelican Beach in Destin. We hope you've enjoyed Bill Dance Saltwater and learned that you can do this. Please join us right here again next week.